birthday. It is coming early in the South Bay. Chula Vista is hosting a big event here this weekend, and you're invited. CBS 8's Chris Crow live with a preview of the festivities for the whole family here, and it's an educational opportunity to knowing what to throw out here. It's something we all have to learn here, Chris. Eric, it's educational and it's also interactive, and that's to try to get the point across that we could all be doing our part. And really, Earth Day should be every day. And joining me right now is Manuel Medrano. And Manuel, when we're talking about South Bay Earth Day, what is the overall message that you all are trying to send here to the residents? It's really to teach uh, about sustainability to all of our residents. Really make sure that everybody is aware of what you could do, the little things you could do to save and live a more sustainable life. And we're going to have a lot of interactive activities here that we'll, we'll kind of show off here. Uh, Chris will. And, uh, you know, when it comes to, to being interactive, does that do you think that that makes an impact, especially with children? Oh, yes. Children will love to all the activities that have a lot of hands on. Uh, there's going to be a, a artist here that will help teach kids how to redo uh, items, how to repurpose items. There's also going to be a fix it clinic, which also is going to work with children to help and, and, and you know everybody to help fix items. We're going to be giving away uh, uh, compost, which is also a really hands on activity. Kids love to get their hands dirty in the, in the, in the dirt. And, and uh, also the caddy giveaways uh, that we're going to do for people to save their food waste from their counter and then put it into their container. And what do you think is probably the biggest misconception when it comes to not necessarily even Earth Day, but environmental services and, and the messages and also, you know, these type of activities that you're trying to engage people on? What do you think is that biggest misconception? Uh, the misconception and really the, the, the part that scares people is that, you know, how, how confusing sometimes things are when it comes to recycling, when it comes to separating your food waste and, and all that. So here you'll learn how to best do it and, and will demystify the, the, the best practices that you could take. Okay, Min Moel, thank you so much. And again, we're going to be showing off a lot of these activities early on this morning that we'll, you'll be able to see full on tomorrow as well as a lot more. And for more information, you can always go to CBS8.com and just click on that story link.